this video is purely going to be based on the weird factor. You know what I'm talking about. Those games you load up or see online and you're all like, um... Oh, what am I looking at exactly? When it's so strange you just don't know how to handle it. So buckle up because we've got 10 of the most bizarre video games ever coming up. And yes, most of them are Japanese. So here we go. Wait, I've forgotten something important. True review here. She with Muscle March. A thief has taken your protein shake and now the football team has gone nuts in pursuit of the pub. But although the team has gone nuts, they've also made the entire experience nuts in the process too. The entire thing is just ridiculous as you chase after criminals that includes a dude dressed as a rabbit who's piggyback riding another dude who's also dressed as a rabbit. A strange game and so here it is at number 10. Takeshi's Challenge! This game is shit! No, really, it's a horrible game and it does not like you. Beat Takeshi wanted to make this one quite hard to figure out, and so he decided to troll the player by getting them to try to progress the story by... Divorcing your wife? Trying to lose at a pachinko machine by yelling at it? Drinking a whole f load of tequila at the bar? And not touching the controller for a solid hour. Or, if you didn't want to do any of that, you could just beat the game by pressing the punch button 30,720 times on the game's title screen, presumably because f*** you. you EnviroBear 2000 It's a well-known fact that bears hibernature in the winter. And the best way to prepare for the harsh weather is for bears to get in the car and drive around looking for food. Wait, I think I must have been watching the Discovery Channel whilst drunk. What makes me laugh with this one is that there are other bears, also in cars, that are trying to get food as well. It's just so... so strange. Lane Goodman. Seven. Seaman! No! Seaman! A quite in-depth game that's only available on the Dreamcast, this game gets you to try to nurture a strange humanoid-like fish creature and then have philosophical debates with them. You've really got to spend time looking after them, and all of it's set in real time, so if they go to bed, then you've got to wait until the next morning for them to wake up again, and one wrong move could mean that they die. Oh, and it's narrated by Leonard Nimoy because... I mean... You know, right? LSD Dream Emulator. Um. Okay. Hats a full boyfriend. Now I like visual novels, and any novel worth its own sort will know not to be too serious and include some unrealistic elements. But if you're gonna make a visual novel based on an anime high school that's filled with talking birds and you have to date them, then... I think you've well and truly lost me there. I mean, I'm surprised that someone came up with this as an idea. And then a team of developers somehow got behind it as well. They must have known that it wouldn't break the box office, didn't they? Yeah, just... Weird. Ski Jumping Paris Reloaded! Okay, the rest of these entries are just funny, and we're starting this off with Ski Jumping Paris Reloaded, which isn't actually a French game. It's... wait for it... It's a Japanese game, obviously. The whole point of this is to see what ridiculous and hilarious stunts and jumps the devs could make the in-game characters pull off whilst on the slopes. And some of them are quite imaginative too. Boonga Boonga! Oh my god, what the f*** on ice! This arcade game requires you to select a character on screen, and then jam your fingers up the butthole provided. No, I wish I was making that up. 
What's worse is that some of the characters you can select to torture include your mum and a child molester. I think that last one would actually enjoy the experience. Chowaniki! <laughs> what? <laughs> Are you serious? It's a game about men. Manly men. Men who are manly. Apparently this game isn't supposed to be homoerotic, however it is supposed to be just having some fun because the developers thought that the most funny humour trope that ever existed is that of muscular men in spandex posing. You know what, this list has gone so weird that I just don't know what to say anymore. The footage is doing all the talking for me. It's been one week since you looked at me Japan World Cup This last one is sort of cheating on my part because it's really just an interactive DVD where you place bets at the start. But look at this! It's like Wacky Races on meth! There's a horse that does ballet! It's just... No, same as before, there's nothing I can say to this! Sorry, this has never happened before. This video is putting me out of a job, so I'm just going to leave you now and let the footage take it from here. See ya!